Before you begin sampling, you'll need to unpack your shipment and prepare your workspace. You'll need to ensure that you are correctly following aseptic technique and then purge your sampling port. In most cases, you will receive either one box with everything you need or two separate boxes. Make sure you keep the boxes because you'll need them for return shipment. Upon receipt, remove the ice packs and place them into a freezer. You will need to store plates in a cool, dry place until you are ready to sample. If you have to travel to take samples, make arrangements upon arrival to freeze the ice packs and to control the plate temperature during transit. This is critical because the plates are temperature sensitive. After you take the samples, you must keep the plates refrigerated to prevent growth of microorganisms before laboratory analysis. To maintain the sterility of the plates, do not open the package until you are ready to sample. Put on your personal protective equipment, also known as PPE. You'll need a clean lab coat, sterile gloves, a protective face mask, a hairnet, and safety goggles or glasses. PPE is a critical part of aseptic technique that should always be included in your sampling plan. Keep in mind that once your gloves are on, you will need to refrain from touching your face or other surfaces not pertaining to the sampling equipment. It is important to stay focused on maintaining aseptic technique throughout the duration of your test. If you do touch another surface with your gloves, make sure that you replace them or use alcohol wipes to prevent contamination. Purge the sampling point for about 10 minutes. During this time, take an inventory of your kit pieces. If this is your first test, then all of the pieces are clean. You will need to clean your kit pieces I, L, and tubing before proceeding to collect additional samples. Feel free to use your own 70% alcohol solution or the provided alcohol wipes. Inspect the plates to make sure they are intact and undamaged. If there are any broken pieces, if the agar is melted, the grid is not aligned properly, or the agar is loose from the plate, contact Trace immediately for replacements. Review and complete sections 1 through 4 on the chain of custody. The Pinocchio Super 2 compressed air sampler is validated at 100 liters per minute for 10 minutes of use. Once the sampling point purge is complete, you will need to regulate the pressure to no more than 60 psi. We have provided accessories including a pressure gauge, control valve, quick disconnects, clamps, and barbs. Now you're ready to put together your Pinocchio sampler. 